All right, thank you for joining us this week. The sun is out, the snow is melting, and the days are getting longer. Sarah and I are recovering from a nasty stomach bug, and we are all ready to get outside and get some sunshine. If you're new to the channel, I'm Caleb. And I'm Sarah. Welcome to this week's vlog. Caleb and I started this week with a horrible stomach bug that laid us out for a couple days. Meanwhile, it started to shine bright outside and melt away the icy grip winter had on us. We finally kicked the bug with only a few days left to film for the vlog, so we took full advantage of the warm weather and ventured outside. Stay tuned, towards the end of the video, I'm going to share three tips on how our family fights sickness at from home. You ready, Eliza? Lucas. You ready, Lucas? Are you ready? Hey, you are a big guy. Did are you, you just shake his head no? Yeah, he did. <laughs> are, are you an unwilling participant in our walk? <laughs> Liza. <laughs> and we have the GoPro attached to Eliza for the Eliza cam. And this is the outfit Eliza chose for today's walk. What are you trying to do here? <laughs> Is this now a game, Lucas? What's your response to this? I think you win. Remember when the silence grew so big it pushed the holes through the sky? I was trying to get this uh, special shot of you like walking by it, but uh, I heard. <laughs> but, um, you stopped and looked at it. <laughs> All right, well, we are about halfway there. How you feeling, Eliza? Pretty good. And yeah, we came across the neighborhood cows. There they are. Pretty sure it was that one that was in my yard eating my bushes this winter. Fun to you. Lucas, what do you think of the cows? Cows? Ooh. Moo! Moo! What is mom doing? He's got to point at stuff. I know, He's not going to keep his hands in there. Cool. You're already recording, dude. You're good. You're recording. Press buttons. No, you're good. You're good. One, two. <laughs> oh man, that sounds like an awesome, awesome lunch, man. What'd you guys do? I heard you guys were gonna go to a garden or something today. Yeah, we did. You went to a garden? What'd you see there, Addy? Um, we saw some radishes. Yeah. You saw radishes? Radishes that your school grows? Uh-huh. But they were all dead. But now we, we planted them because the weeds are gone. And now we also saw oh. so You guys got to do some seed planting today? Living in the great Pacific Northwest comes with many benefits. The vast landscape with topography that changes in every mile, new and beautiful places to explore every single day. It also comes with just about the same amount of challenges from high mountain icy roads, spring runoff that can rip a road in half, to wildfires that can engulf an entire house in minutes. 
even though spring is just around the corner, it's still very cold out. We still need a fire every night to keep us warm. What I'm doing here is cutting wood up to last us through the rest of the winter. We will most likely be relying on this form of heat for the next several months. All right, I just got done sawing up the rest of these logs here. You know, that saw that I was using that you guys just saw there, that thing originally wasn't running at all. Sarah's dad took that and I, cause I'm not much of a mechanic myself, but he took that saw and replaced every single part that can probably possibly be replaced on it. Replaced the clutch, all these tubes so it can suck up gas. It's, uh, I, I really appreciate him doing that. And uh, it feels so nice having a good saw. That thing just absolutely tore through every single one of these logs. So thank you. Okay, so earlier I promised you I would share three at-home wellness tips. I saved my personal favorite for last. If you're like us, your immune system was put to the test last winter. Luckily, we had these very simple tools that helped us a lot, and I know that they'll help you too. Number one, stay hydrated with electrolytes and minerals. You can add them to any beverage like tea or water, or you can drink coconut water with a little salt and a spoonful of honey mixed in. It is so crucial to replenish. Two, soak in a hot detox bath. Just add one cup of baking soda and one cup of Epsom salts to your bath water. This will help your body sweat and release toxins, plus it's super relaxing. Number three, my favorite, is diffuse therapeutic grade essential oils. Not only will they make your home smell amazing, but they will offer benefits and lift your mood. Our family uses Young Living Essential Oils and you can find our link in the description. We frequently share our favorite wellness tips and ways to stay healthier in all of our vlogs. So if you liked this video, you'll probably enjoy our other videos as well. Also, feel free to drop in the comments your own favorite wellness tips.